is setting a goal for yourself. It's setting a destination, setting a place that you say, you know what, this is why I am saving. Giving yourself a reason to save. A lot of times when I first started saving, I was just like, oh, I'm just saving to save. I'm just saving just because. And then I'll look at the account that I'm supposed to be saving in and it's always zero. And I'm like, eh, why is this account just zero all the time? I thought I was saving some money. I thought I had money inside this account. What is going on? Why is there no money inside here? And the thing was basically because I, I was telling myself I'll know when I know or I was telling myself I'm just saving to save. I was telling myself I'm just saving to save. There was no real reason that I wanted to save. I was just like, I just want to save. I just Everybody says to save money, save money, save money. So you know what? Let me save money. But at the end of the day, every time I'm looking at the account, it's always zero. The fact is, unless you have a goal in mind, unless you have somewhere in mind that you want to be, you have somewhere that you've thought about that you're saying, this is the reason why I'm saving. This is the reason why I want to keep this money to the side. You will always dip into that fund. If you don't have a reason to hold yourself back that, let's say, for example, for example, you want to, you want a new car. And so every time you, you, you save, you're like, it's for the new car. 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 The day you go into that account and you're looking at that account and you're like, I need, I want to take some money out. You'll be like, Chai, it will take longer to get this new car. Let me wait. All of a sudden, your mindset, it's basically everything we're doing is to make you think differently. And so it makes you take a pause for a second to be like, that's for the new car. I don't want to touch it. 